Hey guys, so today I wanted to show you how you can access Instagram music from anywhere. So Instagram music, it's an amazing feature, but the challenge is it's only available in the US, UK, New Zealand, Australia, Sweden, France, Canada, and Germany. So outside of those countries, you'll get an error uh, if you're scrolling through Instagram stories and it'll say Insta Instagram music isn't available in your region. The good news is you can bypass these geo restrictions as they're called by changing your virtual location and you can do that using a VPN. So I've tested lots and lots of different VPNs to find the best ones and there's two that I recommend um, because what you need is you want one that's going to have good speed you want one that's going to be effective at changing your uh, location and I also recommend VPNs uh, to use that are great for newbies so if you've never used it before or if you've never used a VPN before it has a great um, uh, interface that makes it easy to use so uh, the two I recommend are ExpressVPN and Surfshark and I'll put links to both of those in the description so that you can take advantage of any deals or discounts that aren't available on their website. So the reason you would want again a VPN to access Inst Instagram music is because due to licensing restrictions Instagram music is only available with users with certain IP addresses in the countries I men mentioned earlier. So in order to make it work, if you live outside of those countries, you need to use a VPN to hide your real address and replace it with an IP address from a country where Instagram music is available. Then you'll be able to listen to and share uh, stories or share songs on Instagram stories. So again, the first one, I, first VPN I recommend is Express, Express VPN. And this is really just the best one overall to get. And that's because it's the fastest. It has uh, the most servers and, and country in the most countries. So it has over 3000 servers in 94 countries. As a result, you're more likely to get great speeds wherever you are in the world. It also has award-winning apps, so the apps uh, make it really easy to use ExpressVPN on a variety of devices. So that could be things like your computer, your laptop, your tablet, your PC, uh, iPhone, Android devices, your smart TV, your routers, whatever it is. And that's one of the strengths of ExpressVPN. You can also connect to up to five devices simultaneously. So that means you could be on your phone, your laptop, someone else could be using a VPN on a, on a TV, and you're all able to uh, access content you wouldn't normally be able to access. You also have live 24-7 chat support uh, in case you have any problems, they're happy to help. And you have a 30-day money-back guarantee. So if you have any problems with it during that time, they're really great about just refunding your money. They want to make sure you are happy with your product. And that's why, again, they're the best and I recommend them. The second one I recommend, second VPN, I should say I recommend, is Surfshark. And again, I'll put a link in the description uh, to Surfshark so you can check them out and also be able to take advantage of any deals or discounts not available on their website. Now, Surfshark is what I consider my favorite budget pick VPN. So if you're willing to sacrifice on maybe a few features and a little bit on performance and still have though a really great VPN, Surfshark would be the way to go. So for example, compared to ExpressVPN, Express has 1,700 servers, whereas Express has 3,000. Surfshark is in 63 countries, whereas ExpressVPN is in 94 countries. So it, again, depends on where you're located in the world. What I recommend is, again, you can use the link in the description, go check out Surfshark, see where their servers are located, and see if, if they um, are located in the country uh, where you would, you would need them. If they are, odds are you'll be able to have great speeds. If you don't have a server currently located in your country, you can still try them out, see how the speeds work. They may still be fine. Or you may just want to go with ExpressVPN and be on the safe side. Now, another advantage of Surfshark, uh, besides the price, is the uh, fact that you get unlimited devices you can connect to. So whereas with ExpressVPN, you get five, 
With Surfshark, it's unlimited. So that means you can have as many family members on as many devices as you'd like. So everyone, you know, people could be on multiple phones, desktop computers, um, tablets, TVs, routers, gaming devices, PS4, and so forth. And that could be again an advantage depending on your situation. Now Surfshark, just like Express, has 24-7 customer support. That's really helpful and uh, great to contact if you have any questions. They also have a 30-day money-back guarantee. And they do have great performance, military-grade encryption, hassle-free gaming and smooth streaming, uh, very fast surfing. Again, it's another very strong VPN. It's just not quite as fast as Express, and you don't necessarily have as many uh, types of apps you can use for uh, more obscure devices or maybe not as popular devices. And so again, it's a great choice. It's just not quite as strong as ExpressVPN. But if you're looking for the best VPN you can get with the while paying the least amount of money, that's where Surfshark really excels. And on top of that, you have the uh, unlimited devices, if that might be a plus for you as well. So hopefully this was help for, helpful for you. Again, feel free to check the links in the description uh, for either ExpressVPN or Surfshark. Certainly you can compare them both. And uh, the uh, links will also take you to any of the best deals or discounts that aren't currently listed on their website. That way you guys can save as much money as possible. Uh, otherwise, if this was helpful, definitely leave a thumbs up. I always appreciate that. And if you have any questions, let me know down in the comments below. I always love getting to ask and help out as much as I can. Uh, really appreciate you guys watching though, um, and I will look forward to seeing you in the next video.